Yo, what's going on guys? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to lower or raise or adjust volume in any way you want in Adobe Premiere Pro, so stay tuned. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long. Yo, what's going on guys? I'm J. Carl Ray from GrowOnYouTube.com teaching you how to be better. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can adjust volume levels in Adobe Premiere Pro. It's quite easy. As you can see, I've got my project in the background. It looks like I'm talking about something being very, very huge, huge, not huge, huge. But let's go, let's get into the video. Now over here, we have the audio track mixer. Generally by default, if you click on something in the timeline, you will usually have your effect controls over here. If you don't have the audio track mixer up here already, then what you need to do is go to the window, go to audio track mixer here, or you can use shift and six if you wanna use the short key, and then you will have your audio tracks over here. And this is generally the best way to adjust your audio. Now over here, you can bring things down, you can raise them, you can mute them, you can solo them and do all that sort of stuff. Let me quickly show you how, how this works by using an example from this video. Let's bring it back a little bit. This is my how to get review codes video. If you guys want to know how to get review codes for your games, then this is a good video to check out. But let's play. Ooh. Hmm. Oh shit, I'm not actually <laughs> I'm not actually capturing audio from the desktop right about now, so there's actually no point in me playing anything back. Sorry about that, but just know that this does work. Let me actually mute this, but play it in the background so you guys can see the audio track. So you can see that it's going down as I pull this down. But obviously that is moving shopping in the background because I've got my adjustment layer with my color correction on but basically that is how you do it over here and this will control all these audio tracks over here so as you can see my main audio is on audio one then on audio two is some other audio <laughs> and then on audio three we got some other audio and so on and so forth and that is how you can mix all those audio tracks together. Another way to change your audio and adjust it is to come down to the timeline, right click on the audio that you want to adjust and go to audio gain. Now this will allow you to, I, I'm not sure if you can go minus with this, let's see if we can go minus. Yeah you can. So this will allow you to lower the volume and raise the volume but as you can see it goes on a clip by clip basis and then you can, as far as I know, copy this audio gain across the rest of your clips, but it's just not worth it. Just use the audio track mixer, it's so much easier. I don't know why you'd ever wanna go with audio gain, but if you've got like a particularly loud part of your video, then of course you could split it up and use the audio gain to make it a little bit lower without having to make a whole new audio track. So. I hope this video helped you guys out. If you want to upgrade your editing and help out the channel, then go to growonyoutube.com forward slash Red Giant now. Red Giant make a bunch of plugins that make complicated editing techniques easier. The titles and transitions that you've just seen were created using Red Giant Universe. Red Giant plugins like Universe and the Magic Bullet Color Suite help me save time and allow me to create professional looking content for you guys. The best thing is that you can try their plugins out for free. So go to growonyoutube.com forward slash Red Giant to try those plugins out for free now. If you decide that you like their plugins after trying them out for a bit, you can use the code JCARTARRAY for 10% off your purchase. Get your free trial of any of these awesome plugins now and make your editing life easier at growonyoutube.com forward slash red giant. Before you guys go, I just wanna let you know that you can download your free SEO for noobs checklist down below in the description. So be sure to get that. This checklist will help you get more views and subscribers by making sure that with every video you put up, you're optimizing that video and you're giving it the best chance to rank in search. So definitely download that. It should help you guys out a ton and I'll see you guys in the next YouTube guide. Remember to be better. 
It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long So all this warmth I share with you